What's happening, my people? So, just finished watching The Walking Dead. This is this is episode five, I think. Uh, to be honest, I really don't have too much to say. It, it was a, a decent episode. It was the females starring in the episode. Uh, Maggie, Maggie and Sasha. They at the hilltop. They just dealing with their leader in showing how strong they are compared to his way of doing things. Uh, I guess it shows how if you continue to let the saviors push you around, you can become like him. And that's maybe the future for Rick and them if they continue down that path. I guess. I'm, I'm trying to say anything deep or look into some meaning to it but to be honest this episode was it was it was weak they had parts like uh like sasha sasha and jesus when they was fighting the walkers outside and then whenever maggie got into the tractor and ran them over that was some highlights of the episode uh that's about it when the saviors ran up in in the spot and they bullied the leader, bullied Greg's name or something. I don't know. I'm bad with names. But they bullied the leader in He was trying to sell Sasha in, in them out. He was gonna he was gonna get them killed or whatever. But luckily they were smart enough to go to a different spot. Uh Carl finally got him got his little first little kiss. So that happened. He's on his way, what he's trying to go kill Negan, you gonna get fucked up. But they ain't about to let Carl die, but uh, you crazy as hell. Luckily they got Jesus, Jesus should steer him right and get him, get him off of that thought pattern for now. Like, you, you crazy as hell, you think you about to go and kill Negan? Man, you stupid. You stupid. Uh, shit. I want, I want to say something regarding last episode. Uh, my uncle was talking about it. He showed, showed me it. Whenever last episode, they had Daryl, and Daryl wasn't talking at all. And whenever he went visit uh, his, his old group, when he was with Negan, I, I wouldn't say visit, when he was prisoner of Negan, and they was messing with him, and they was, uh, uh, Rick looked at him, and Daryl was, doing like this he was blanking real crazy and Rick was like it was Mars cold if you look they they show it in, in Rick Rick's house where they stay they have a chart and they walk by it in the episode and it shows Mars cold chart so he was blanking in Mars cold and I think what he was blanking it was I east he was saying when Negan and them is it they are they are uh, east and I don't know I East. I don't know if there's this interstate East or something. I don't know if there's a road or certain, but it's something regarding East. And that's where Negan and them is at. So he trying to help out some kind of way and give them a little uh a little hint or a little uh I don't know, tip them off to try to have some kind of upper hand. Uh and that's about all, all I can say. This this gonna be this is gonna be a quick one because they don't have too much to say about this episode. Uh, stay tuned. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay tuned to the episodes and see what's see what happened the next episode. Hopefully it, it gets better. This this was a this was a, a low episode. I I guess because it's just not my favorite characters in the hilltop. The hilltop is kind of boring. They little community. I really don't it really don't do nothing for me. I'd rather see Ezekiel. And them, uh, I'd rather see the kingdom. The kingdom seem more exciting. They have more people in the tiger and Ezekiel is just more charismatic. Uh, they leader in the hilltop is just whack. And if you read the comic book, Maggie is about to be the leader of the hilltop. So that's about to happen. And uh, my eyes looking low. I'm tired. But uh, fuck with your boy. Like, comment, subscribe. Gonna be the greatest of the most hated. Stay tuned to Walking Dead. Like they paying me or something. I'm pushing the hell out of this show. I need to do power. Whenever power come back, I need to do that. Because that's my show. 
Power and Game of Thrones. That's my shit. I gotta start doing those when they comes back. But uh, fuck with me.